Hello everyone, my name is Tor and welcome or welcome back to Anthropology. All right, thank you for joining me in today's video. If this is your first time, welcome to the channel. I hope you enjoy your stay. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. I really appreciate the engagement. So today we will be talking about my Coach Hitch backpacks in the 13 size. I believe that's what they're called. It's their mini size. And I have them both in the Coach Signature Jacquard print. So this is what we're going to be reviewing today. These models are, are not currently available on the website um, because they were seasonal releases, but the style still exists in their signature canvas as well as in a really nice brown leather. And I'm sure they're going to come out with more. So this is just a general review of the size of the style um, and also what I think of Coach's Jacquard. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, please continue watching and please subscribe and like if you feel so compelled. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, let's start off with some dimensions. So this is a micro bag. It is very, very small, um, but it does fit quite a bit. So it is five inches in terms of length, eight and a quarter inches in terms of uh, height, and two and a half inches in terms of width. So not too much, but can fit all of your daily essentials. Fits most phones. I have the iPhone um, 11, I think. I don't know. I have an old one, but it fits no problem. It has quite a roomy inside, so you can fit a lot. I'll do a, like a little demo of what fits, as well as one pocket in here that you can fit either like a card holder or anything like that. It also has these two compartments on either side. These ones, I believe they're a bit more decorative, to be honest. You can't, you could can fit some things in there. Fitting them in is the easy part. Getting them out, now that's a challenge. So I use these as a bit more decorative, or if you want to put some cards in there, something that may be a little bit harder to get, but you want to bring with you anyway. On the back, we have these three D-rings. These are for the nice long shoulder strap that we have. So this is a very uh, significant webbing strap. Each strap is a little bit different from bag to bag. I really like that they they keep them in line. So as you can see from my yellow one, we have a brown strap with yellow leather accents. On the green one, we have a black strap with green accents. So they made them quite custom, which I do appreciate. The strap is a uh, convertible, so you can do long, short, whatever you want. Comes with a coach tag, which you can hot stamp. I have not yet, but you can. The total strap drop is 21 and three quarter inches. So it's quite a big strap. You can make it long. I don't have it on the longest one um, by far, but it just has these lobster claws, which make it very easy to use and strap on and off your back. So I'm just gonna read from the Coach website a little bit about why they made this bag and some editor's notes. The Coach website says, Mini Me, we made a scaled down version of our customer favorite hitch backpack with all the same details as the original. Finished with a lightweight webbing crossbody strap inside pockets, the Petite 13 holds a large phone, cash cards, and keys. It's crafted in refined leather and our micro signature jacquard made with recycled polyester and cotton sourced from farms that use our regenerative agricultural practices. Those that help to maintain and rejuvenate the land increase biological diversity and soil health and could lead to increased carbon absorption. It reflects our ongoing commitment to helping reduce our impact on the planet. Love that we have a little green moment, both literally and figuratively. So why I picked these two. I first came across this one at the Ala Moana store in Hawaii, and I literally saw it in the sales section. And I said, um, you will be coming home with me. What I really liked about it was I had sold my yellow Celine bag, cry, and I was missing a yellow bag in my collection, or at least that's the justification I told myself in order to say, hey, you should get that bag. From there, I tried it on and I fell in love. What I love most is that Coach really kept true to making sure that every part of this bag was solidly constructed. It has the Coach little embossing on every piece of the metal, including these little D-rings. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see on the front. It just has Coach New York right there. 
I really like these little straps. These are decorative, so you cannot change the length. Let's see what fits. Okay, so let's do a little what fits, shall we? Let's hold it open like this. So first, we have my new Celine card holder. You can do a review on this if you want. I just put it right in there like so. Next, this is my Deadly Ponies pouch where I keep all of my like hand sanitizer and stuff. Shove that right at the bottom. Next, we have a L'Occitan hand cream. My Louis Vuitton mirror, which I got from Farfetch a while ago. My house keys. Shake it down in there. My old AirPods. I always like to carry a perfume with me. This one is the LV Ombre Nomade. Love a good perfume sample. Next, sugar. Ooh. Fresh sugar lip balm. And also my car keys. So, fits a ton. No bulging or anything. Obviously, I am using my phone to film, so I didn't put that in there, but you could if you really wanted to. Now, obviously, I didn't use the sides, but let me show you what it's like to get something in and out because I said it was a bit of a nightmare. So let's use this. No, it's too big. Let's use this. So say I wanted to put this on the side, open it up, pop it in, and voila. But now comes the hard part. Okay. No, that actually wasn't that hard. So this is an up close of this bag. I really like the jacquard and the top stitch. Little webbing on the back, how cute. And now it's like a nice up close of this one as well. The green is really pretty. In certain lights, it actually looks black, which I love. And on the back, you can see the D-rings. So, some pros. Very cute. Very easy to wear, to fill, to utilize. When I wear it, to wrap, super easy to use. And I normally wear mine on the front, like so. Very easy to access everything. You just go whoop, like that. So it's a very functional bag. It's very cute. Obviously love the colors that it came in for myself and the price. So these originally retailed for 480 Canadian dollars. I got these both for under 250 Canadian dollars because they were 40% off and I got an additional 10% off when I purchased this one. As I purchased it from the website, gave them my email, got an extra 10% off, which why not? So I love these. I think they're so cute. I think they're really functional and I love the colors. Um, now in terms of wear, this one, I don't know if it came with that, but it's a little bit of scratching there. I'm not too concerned. These parts are gonna wear as that's where this metal will come into contact with them. And obviously as you wear things, but let me just show you a little, little on body. So here's how it looks from the front. You can obviously change the sides depending on if you want it on one side or just go like this. And now suddenly it's a swing on the other side. And then to put it, you can also wear it on the back like so. So it just swings. And it's very easy to use if you want to keep it on the back or keep it on the front. And often to take it off, I just unclip one. Of course it's not working. And then you can reclip it and right back on the front. Okay, so that's my video. Overall, I rate this bag very highly. I feel like if you can get it on sale, there's nothing better. 
The colors that they come in are super cute. It's very well constructed. Um, currently on the Coach website and in store, they have a full leather version for I believe it's like 550 Canadian, 400 and something, 480 US. And then they have the uh, coated canvas version in black as well. Um, I believe it's like 480 Canadian and then 395 US if I'm not mistaken. So if you're looking for this type of swing bag and you want one that very well made, not going to break the bank, also, you know, a nice brand, then I would definitely recommend the Hitch Backpack. Um, I know Louis Vuitton does a similar one, the Small Christopher. That one is 10 times the price at around 3,200 Canadian. So if you're looking for one that holds a lot, not going to break the bank definitely recommend this one. So thank you all for watching. I'll leave a few videos down below as well if you're interested and I'll see y'all next time. Bye guys.